Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel, Gamerholic here, and in today's video we're going to be seeing how long it actually takes to scuttle ships. Okay, so we're going to be testing all three, Sloop, Brigantine and Galleon, and it's from the moment when I press scuttle to the moment that the mermaid pops up. So the first one we're going to be doing is the Brigantine today. So let's, let's go and check out how long it takes to scuttle a brig. So there we go, it was roughly 57 to 58 seconds. Okay, so the next ship up is the Sloop, and it is worth mentioning that I'm doing this all in deep water and not in shallow water, because I reckon shallow water would affect the animation, and potentially it may make the time slightly longer. Obviously, if you are doing it with a ship that's already damaged as well, that also could affect the timings. These are all brand new ships, so there's no damage or anything like that. It's just the times it takes to scuttle from a fresh. Okay, so let's get on with the sloop and get everything in place, and here we go. So there we go, we've got 56 seconds. So just a second more quicker for a sloop compared to a brig. And finally, we're going to be doing the galleon. So let's get everything in place and away we go. So there we go, it took exactly one minute. So again, a little bit more time because it's a bigger ship, maybe the reasoning, but we're only talking a second apart from each one. Okay, so there is my first video on my Did You Know series. I do the science so you don't have to. If you have any ideas or any questions that you didn't really want answering, then feel free to pop them in the comments and I may be able to uh, 
answer them in the very near future. Thanks everyone for watching today. If it has been useful or interesting, then please do consider liking, sharing, commenting and subscribing. Have a great rest of your voyages, scuttle those ships in time and take care. Yeah.